the Clipspringer antelope, scientifically known as Oreotrigus oreotrigus, is a small and remarkable member of the Bovidae family. Native to the rocky terrains and mountainous regions of eastern and southern Africa. The name Clipspringer, which means a rock jumper in Afrikaans, speaks to their incredible ability to navigate steep, rocky cliffs with ease. They have specialized hooves with rubber-like pads that provide exceptional grip, allowing them to leap and bound across steep, rocky landscapes with ease. These antelopes have large, forward-facing eyes that give them excellent binocular vision. This trait is crucial for spotting predators from a distance and navigating their rocky habitats safely. The Clipspringers have a short, coarse coat that is a mixture of gray, brown, and white. The horns of Clipspringer antelopes are used for defense against predators and rival males. Clipspringers are small, standing about 17 to 24 inches tall at the shoulder and weighing between 8 and 18 kilograms. Despite their diminutive size, Clipspringers possess powerful hind legs that allow them to leap up to 25 feet in a single bound. Unlike many other antelope species, Clipspringers are known to form monogamous pairs. A male and female will often stay together for life. Both males and females are highly territorial, often marking their territory with dung piles. They use their keen sense of smell to detect intruders, and they will aggressively defend their home range. Clipspringers primarily feed on a variety of succulent plants, leaves, and fruits, which provide most of the water they need. They rarely drink water directly, relying on the moisture content of their food to stay hydrated. In the wild, clipspringers can live up to 15 years, though their lifespan can be shorter due to predation and environmental factors. Predators such as leopards, eagles, and hyenas pose a constant danger to these small antelopes. Human encroachment and habitat destruction are also significant threats to clipspringers, as urban development and agriculture continue to encroach upon their natural habitats. They are listed as least concern by the IUCN Red List.